and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a collective haul for you. I've been buying a few things here and there for about over a month now and I thought I would share with you guys um, what I purchased, what I got, um, all that good stuff. So I'm going to start with the items that I bought first and then work to what I got today. So the first few things I got um, are face products. And I really needed some new face stuff just because I needed them. Um, so I got the Maybelline Dream Liquid Mousse in Light 1. I used to use this a lot. Um, it's good for medium to full coverage. And this is great for when I'm at work and I don't want my makeup to fall off or dissolve or anything like that. It's really really good um so I definitely went back to it but then I got the Maybelline Master Conceal Camouflage and Concealer in Tin Fair um it's still a little dark for me but I can um cover some most of my stuff most of the blemishes that I have with it but um I really like this it stays all day so I'm really really liking that then I got a City Color Be Matte Blush, and this is in Toasted Coconut. This is a more cool tone, um, like brown color. And I wanted to get NYX's Taupe Blush, um, but this was a lot cheaper, and it's about the same, so I thought I would grab it. Um, then I bought the Brow Fix Brow Kit from Milani, and this is in medium. Yeah, medium. Um, it's perfect for my brows because my hair is a lot lighter, um, so I can kind of mix the two and get, like, the perfect shade for my brows. It's what I'm wearing on them today, and I love how this kit has a little, like, angled brush and an eyeshadow brush and some tweezers, so you don't have to bring all that if you're going somewhere, and it's all in a really cute compact. Um, then I got the City Colors All Set Setting Spray with Silica. Um, I love my Motives Face uh, Setting Spray, but I really wanted to try something new, so I saw this, and I'm a big fan of City Colors, so I thought I would pick this up and try it. I've really been liking this so far. It has um, an in not an interesting smell, but it just it smells really good. Um, but the smell does evaporate over time, so, you know, if you're very sensitive with, with smell, I would not suggest this, but, um, I've really been liking this, so, I'm very happy. Um, and then I bought the Milani Eyeshadow in Bella Chiffon. This is a really good, um, highlighter color. Um, I have it on my eyes just all over today. Um, it's really soft and really pigmented. It's great for inner corner highlights, brow bone highlights all over. It's just like the perfect um, kind of vanilla e shade. I really love it. Then, um, Oh My Lash had a sale going on, and you could get like two pairs of lashes for like the price of one or something. Um, so I got two sets of false lashes. I got the Sophia set. And I got the Isabella set, and these will be great for cosplay and um, just, you know, more dramatic looks. Some of these have, they're mostly more subtle lashes, except for like this one, and maybe one of them in here. Um, but I'm really glad I got it. I only spent like $13, and if you guys purchase from On My Lash, you know that one of them is like $13. So... It was like buy one get one free, so I was very very happy with this purchase, and I can't wait to use them. Then I went and got some daily repair cream. This is from Nicelle, and it's vitamin A and retinol anti wrinkle cream. I really wanted to get some kind of cream for my face for during the day or at night to help with my hyperpigmentation. I'd noticed I've been getting like wrinkles under my eyes really bad. So I really wanted to get something to kind of help my skin. Um, it's been suffering because it's been A, I've been putting on makeup every single day and B, I have to, you know, go out a lot um, with the harsh weather that Georgia has because it's either really, really sunny 
or really, really cold and raining. Does nothing in between. So it's just been kind of crazy, and my skin's been acting really weird lately. So I wanted to get that. And then I got the Fun Perfume. This is a, so I got this at Five Below, and it's like their version of the Victoria's Secret Very Sexy um, perfume. It smells exactly the same. It lasts on my skin all day, and I'm like, why spend all that money on Victoria's Secret perfume when I could get this for five bucks? I don't know. Maybe I'm cheap. I don't know, but <laughs> I just, I don't know. It's like if you can find the exact same scent for a cheaper price, why not get it, you know? I mean, hey, you know, you got the money to spend, that's cool, whatever, but, you know, I, 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 I can't do that. <laughs> and then the next few items actually um, were sent, um, so I'm just going to kind of show you guys quickly. It's I got the Maybelline Master Prime Primer in Blur and Illuminate. I really love this, especially since my skin has been really dull lately. I put it on underneath my foundation, and it just gives me a really nice glow, and I really like that. Then I got the Sleek um, Blush by 3 palette in Lace, and I'm so in love with these colors. They're really peachy and pretty. Um, these two are matte, and this one has a shimmer to it, and this reminds me of the NARS Orgasm Blush, which I'm really loving, and it doubles as a highlighter as well. So I'm so happy to get this. I love sleek products, so when I was sent this, I was very, very happy. Then I got sent to um, Makeup Revolution Salvation Velvet Lip Lacquers, and I got the colors in Velvet Black Heart, which is a really dark purpley black, and then You Took My Love, which is a really fun hot pink. And I'm so happy to have these. I've been, like, drooling over them for a while. And I'm just really, really happy to get these. And then I got a Essence Lipstick in Funky Funky. And it's a really pretty shimmery purple. I haven't tried it out yet, but I love purple lips. So I'm very happy to have this in my collection. So the next few things that I have are body jewelry. Um, I wanted to get some kind of uh, stud rings for my cartilage piercing because I had an um, eyebrow ring in there just to kind of hold it over and we have to wear headsets at work so it kept getting hung so I was like no this ain't gonna work because it's gonna rip it out my ear and we're gonna have a problem. So the first one I got is what I'm wearing today. I don't know if you can see it but it's a black heart and it has like little rhinestones in it I'm very happy with it. And I got these from bodycandy.com and they have the most affordable body jewelry ever. Like, it's ridiculous. And then I got this one, which is a little bow. I don't know if, how well you can see it, but it's a bow with like rhinestones on it. And it's 18 gauge for anyone who's wondering. And then I got a lime green heart. You can, I doubt you can see through here, but it's a heart. Um, I like to keep them in the packages until I use them, just, you know, sanitary reasons. <laughs> and then I got some little star stud earrings, um, just for work. And then I got some little purple studs. If you can see them, let's see if I can, like, slide them out, because they're in a little tube. I know. Really cool. So, I'm very happy with that, and I only spent like 10 bucks on all these items, so I'm very, very happy. And then I got my ColourPop order, which I've been dying to get some ColourPop, and I decided why not. So, I just got it today, so I haven't like tested them out or anything, but I'm going to show you guys what I got. Um, the first one is, the first one I got is a shimmery silver color, and it is in Liberty, and I'm really, really excited. I got, um, quite a few neutrals this time around just for work, um, and I can easily put it on, and this is a Super Shock one. 
Then I got Fantasy, which is a really deep purple with lots of glitter. I picked up Get Lucky, which is a really pretty Super Shock uh, gold color. Then I got Eye Candy, which is like a pinky, mauve color, which is really pretty. I got Slave to Pink, which is a fun hot pink because it was calling my name. I got Fizz, which is a hotline green. Girly, which is a really pretty, like, beigey color. I got a uh, Birthday Girl, which I'm loving this packaging. It was uh, free, so, you know, you can't beat that. Um, it was part of their birthday birthday. Um, limited edition collection so they threw that in which I'm happy about because I was kind of eyeing that color <laughs> for a while and the last eyeshadow I got Lisa, which is a really pretty teal color which I'm loving so much so much love and that is my haul <laughs> from the past like month month and a half um, I really hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you guys like more hauls, um, definitely give me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below. Um, if you want any review for any of these items that I just showed you, let me know in the comments below, and I would definitely do that for you guys. Um, you guys definitely requested more hauls, so I wanted to do some for you and kind of show you what I've been kind of collecting over the past month or so. Um, yeah, so you'll probably see these in an upcoming favorites video. Um, if you guys want to see a May favorites, let me know in the comments below as well. Um, there was only a few products that I liked for the month of May, but, you know, if you guys want to see that, let me know. Um, so, yeah, uh, I hope you guys are having a great day. And also, I recently just went to MomoCon, so if you guys want to check out my experience at MomoCon and what I purchased, I'm going to have the link below so you can check that out. I got to meet Yaya Han, and I'm still kind of on cloud nine about that. Even though I've already met her, I met her again, and I was just like, yes! So, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, and subscribe if you have not, and I will talk to all of you later. Bye!